I have another computer to fix. Rock and roll. So what's up y'all? I'm kind of making this video honestly a little bit late into the repair cycle. I don't really know why I didn't think to make one earlier. Um, but uh, today I have an HP I'm working on. Uh, I've actually been working on it the last two days, whatever like that. Uh, but uh, it's pretty messed up. So first off, I think it was in a drop. So that's uh, always nice, you know. Uh, there's the old screen, which is shattered as fuck. Uh, so yeah, the new screen went in really easily, uh, and that uh, was all nice and dandy and everything. I mean, that's all really uh, pretty, pretty easy to do, you know, just pop off the bezel and put a new screen on, and it's actually really, really simple with this uh, model HP. There was other issues, as you can maybe tell, like by the screws and everything. The computer's still apart. Uh, I just have it together to boot up into Windows, but it had some other issues, like this. What is this, y'all? Do you guys know what, uh, what this little thing is right here? It's a CMOS battery that's not in the computer. <laughs> uh, so whenever you boot up the computer, it's like, whoa, there's no CMOS battery. And it's like, uh, yeah, because it's right there. Uh, so um, basically, I need to uh, re-solder that back on the motherboard. Never done any soldering before, so I'm going to have to learn how to do that really quick. Uh, but uh, I bought a soldering kit, and uh, I've seen a lot of stuff on soldering. I just haven't actually done it, but I got some flux, and I bought a soldering kit. My dad had a soldering iron, but I feel like it's not really for uh, electric uses, I feel like. Um, even though maybe it could have been, but I kind of just wanted my own kit. Um, so there we go with that. Also, on top of the screen being broken and the CMOS battery being totally broken off the motherboard, uh, on top of that, the hard drive was toast as fuck. Like, I haven't seen a hard drive this bad in a while. Uh, Windows would obviously not boot. Um, the fact that I have, like, I put a hard drive in here and it's from one of my old PCs. I just gave her a used hard drive that I formatted, deleted all the uh, content off of it and everything. For whatever reason, like, Windows had the shittiest time installing on here. I think it's because the BIO settings are kind of fucked up. Probably because that battery is not in there. Um, so I had to fix some BIO settings and kept tinkering around with it forever. Finally got Windows 10 in there and it activated, so that's ballin'. And got some Windows updates in there as well, which is cool. Uh, but, um, yeah, as you guys can maybe tell, here is the hard drive that was in there with that little yellow sticker on there right next to Foxy. And, uh, yeah, just watching some KWAR Speedy while I'm fixing the shit, but, uh, I had to download, uh, this program, Data Rescue uh, PC4, um, in order to actually back up the data, and I think it actually stalled, even though I used the trial to make sure it actually found the data, and it did. Um, so the customer agreed to pay for that, but, like, see, if I bring up the hard drive, that's her hard drive. Windows will not recognize it unless it's formatted, so that's nice. So the hard drive is definitely pretty fucked up. And whenever I bring up a crystal disk info, it's it's like, you know what, this thing's kinda fucked up. So we'll see if this uh, if this can actually back up the data. It looks like it will from the trial, but so far it looks like it's not really doing much. But uh, we'll see, so uh, just figured I'd give you guys a little update on the computer. And, um, I don't know, I'll keep you guys updated as, as well as the soldering goes. Probably not going to put that on camera because I've never soldered before, and, uh, I don't know if it's going to go well, but, uh, we'll see. I'm chilling with the cat today. Say hi, Charlie. Alright, so here's an update on the, uh, laptop that I was fixing. Uh, so I think in the last video, I showed that I had Windows 10 on it. Uh, she just wanted to use hard drive, so, uh, I have a, a couple laptops back there that uh, people just gave me because they were kind of broken. Um, but like, you know, you can tell which parts off them and stuff like that. So I uh, put used hard drive in here, but it's working nicely actually. Uh, Windows 10 works really well on hard drives. I've, I'm used to just using it on an SSD, but Windows 10 actually works really well on a hard drive, uh, which is cool, I guess, even though I still like SSDs. Um, so yeah, I replaced the screen. I don't know if I showed it in the last video, but that's the screen, very messed up. Uh, so the screen is replaced, which is nice. Hard drive's replaced. Also did some soldering, which was really, uh, really actually very interesting. Um, oh, I still have, the, still have the time wrong on there. Damn it, I need to change that. Um, but, uh, so, uh, I'll show a picture. Um, this is the first time I've ever done any soldering, and I thought I kept screwing it up because, uh, Windows was like, uh, Windows was still, uh, like, having issues booting because 
Um, I needed to change some bio settings and um, whenever you don't have the battery in, it automatically like reverts bio settings back to default or whatever. Um, so I was having issues with that, but finally figured it out. And look at that, it's working good and uh, there's no issues with the BIOS. So the battery is being detected uh, on the motherboard because I did awesome job soldering, of course. I actually had to buy a soldering kit up here. I bought a pretty cheap one on Amazon uh, for 25 bucks, but like it comes in a toolbox. Came with everything, the solder, desoldering wire, soldering iron, a bunch of different head uh, fittings and stuff like that. Uh, it was actually really freaking awesome. So, um, soldering is actually kind of cool. Uh, I'm kind of interested to do that to do that again, maybe later on. Um, but uh, let's see, what else do we have going on? Still trying to back up the hard drive. Um, having some issues doing it, but uh, yeah, I did get the paid version of this, and uh, I don't know. We'll see what how that goes, I guess. Uh, so yeah, that's the computer pair right there. It's uh, working pretty well. Um, I guess beyond that, all I got to say is. I am going to be having a video on that laptop pretty soon, that's the one that's just 10 years old. Um, I, I'm doing, I, I did a bunch of upgrades to it and stuff like that, which I don't think I talked about in a previous video, so I'll talk about that. And then Charlie, of course, he's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful cat. What's up, buddy? How you doing? Uh, <laughs> but uh, I think that's pretty much all I got to say for today. Got some computer parts here, by the way. I haven't showed this in a video yet, but look at that puppy. Oh, oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. So that'll be the boot drive on the Ryzen PC. Uh, the Ryzen CPU is apparently supposed to be here this week. Um, I pre-ordered it on Amazon and they still kind of shipped it late for a moment. Uh, but uh, I think that's all I got to say for now. But I'll see you crazy motherfuckers later. Hey Charlie, how you doing? Oh man, are you so cute? Look at you. You want to sniff the camera? Oh, it's interesting, isn't it buddy? Okay, thanks for watching the video guys. See you later.